a ground report by India today. Now, there is, in fact, a cold wave that's gripped many parts of North India, and most of us prefer to stay indoors to beat the cold. Our brave Javans, however, with temperatures touching minus 20 degrees Celsius and even lower than that, continue to guard our borders. Ashrafani filed this report from Uri sector. There are no off days at the line of control. The Indian Army soldiers deployed in the Uri sector are guarding the frontiers at a bone-chilling minus 20 degrees temperature. India today hit the ground to bring to you firsthand the hazards faced by our brave Javans living hundreds of miles away from their homes to serve their motherland. The team is on the way to one of the extreme forward army posts on the LOC in North Kashmir. After the heavy snowfall last week, the whole region is under a thick white cover. This road was closed for a week. The Border Roads Organization has finally cleared the route for troops posted to forward locations. Mainly the major concern of this uh, snowfall is the threat of snow avalanches in these far-flung and hilly areas where the accumulation of snow gets triggered into the avalanches. That is the major threat for the coming days, particularly in those areas which are avalanche prone. There is never a lull in the forward areas, from open attacks to infiltration. The threats are multiple. Even in times of peace, the Indian soldier is ready for any eventuality. The brave hearts of the Indian Army are on highest ever alert as there are apprehensions that the infiltrators are using these tactics for the infiltration where weather is very bad, it is heavily snowing because we have seen last year, in fact, even today the inputs with the security forces are that the bad weather is an opportunity for infiltration. That is why the army jawans on the line of control on are high alert. The vigil is much needed as the enemy has changed strategy. During the past few years, most of the infiltrations on LOC were observed during such bad weather. This makes the vigil during these harsh winters even more important. We have seen during last many years that the winter season is being chosen by the infiltrators to infiltrate into Jammu and Kashmir. And that is why the army has been put on high alert all across the line of control to file any kind of infiltration and also there are inputs that bad weather when it is snowing when it, it is low visibility that is the time when most of the infiltration bits took place to file those infiltration bits we are seeing that round the clock army soldiers are guarding this fence here on the line of control coping with this weather is itself a challenge the soldiers are equipped with special clothing and light weaponry. We have a snow coat that is white color. We have a climate that is right. And now we have a snow coat that is right. And now we have a snow coat that is right. And now we have a snow coat that is right. And now we have a snow coat that is right. And now we have a snow coat that is right. And now we have a snow coat that is right. And now we have a snow coat that is right. And now we have a snow coat that is right. And now we have a snow coat that is right. And now we have a snow coat that is right. And now we have a snow coat that is right. And now we have a snow coat that is right. और इसका जो रेट ऑफ फायर है वह साढ़े छः से साढ़े आठ सौ राउंड प्रति मिनट है इस हथियार का वजन कम है इन सास राइफल की वनस्पत और इसका रेट ऑफ फायर बहुत अच्छा है उसके पीछा एज बी सेड अर्लियर देर आर नो ऑफ डेज एट द लाइन ऑफ कंट्रोल द वॉच हेयर कंटिन्यूज राउंड द क्लॉक विद अशानी ब्यूरो रिपोर्ट इंडिया टूडे